What's going on, family? Welcome back to Meech and Monica. Thank you guys for watching. I'm not going to say the last video, the last live. So I actually left that um, live up so you all could kind of get like the updates and um, new information. Demetrius actually shared what was going on with him. So if you did not catch that live, that video is still up. So just kind of go back and watch that video. Today I am actually, I have a few errands to run but i'm actually at costco right now a lot of you asked me to share you know like different meal ideas and you know things like that if you wanted to kind of um eat a little healthier and stuff like that i would insert just different stuff here and there you know in vlogs that i may be cooking or making for the meat just when i can of course i'm pretty sure you all know i have a lot on my plate right now with um you know getting adjusted to this and doctor's appointments and um i still have a business to run i still have kids i still have to make sure i take care of myself but i'm pretty sure you all know that and you understand that so i have been um reading messages and emails here and there it may take me a minute to get through them because like i said i have a lot going on right now but i wanted to bring you all with me today because i'm going to costco of course i want to go into hobby lobby something that i need to go in there for but i want to kind of look around because it's been a minute since i've been in hobby lobby and then once i get home i'll kind of share with you all maybe um one of demetrius meals because i know I, I need to fix something for him when i get home and yeah and i think that's about it for today but i'm i hope this vlog is not like all over the place today but i'm just gonna try to um vlog here and there kind of take you all with me throughout the day and um yeah so let's head into costco i don't know how much i'm gonna video because i do um have quite a bit that i have to do today but i will try to show you all just some bits and pieces of my costco trip along with my Hobby Lobby trip, and then I will see you all once I make it home. I am still loving this section of y'all. I really, really am. Okay, let's see what else, what else they got. They still have the chair that I bought for Demetrius. I think a few of you asked me how much it was, and it's $5.99, but it was on sale for like four something when I purchased it have this little coffee table set look at that i was looking for a table like this size to go in our uh, family room area they must have just put this out because i was in here last week and i didn't see this that is cute it's 269 they have this queen bed set i think i'm gonna show this to dylan because he needs a new bed and he wants something that sit low. So I think that'll be perfect. That one is 549. So yeah, I'm gonna have to show him this bed. Let me see if they got a picture of it. Let's see. Oh yeah, and that look like it sit low. That's a king right there, but um, I think they have one queen left. And then I think they have the dresser to go to match. Yeah, and they have the nightstand. Uh, you can put some stereo equipment in that's there. Nice. Yeah. And that's 549. Oh, this one is nice. It goes with that same bed. And that one is 649. That's a nice table set. They don't have, oh yes they do. Oh, so that's it right here. So that one is $7.99 for a nine piece. Oh, okay, so it's it has um eight chairs and then a table for $7.99. I like that, I like that color. And it also seats eight. So if you are in the market for some furniture, oh, I'm really loving this piece right here. Oops. 
Georgia. That's nice. I like that. How much is that one? I don't see the price for that one. But that's nice. That's how it look, y'all. This is the nightstand. I think I just showed y'all a picture, but that's the nightstand. That's nice, too. So I think, I don't know, we may get that for Dylan. It's like a whole set. You got the nightstand, the um, dresser, or you can either get like the dresser that was on the other side and then the bed. Those are cute, too, that little um, shelf unit. That's nice. This is not a bad deal. They have this painting set. It's $19.99. So that's not a bad deal. It look like it have a lot of stuff in it. This is everything that it has in it. They even have this little two-pack, um, like a tabletop wall shield. Look at that, it's $79.99 for two. That's not bad, so if you need something like that. Look at this sink deal, y'all. Now that is not a bad deal. It comes with the sink, the cutting board, and the faucet. I mean, this is a huge sink. It kinda reminds me of like the farm. I think it actually is like the farmhouse sink. But this is everything that it comes with, and it's $349.99. That is a good deal. I'm guessing it's a good deal. But that's a huge thing. I like this shower head, too. I think we may eventually upgrade to something like this just because it has that handle on it. But I like that. But that one is $79.99. And then they have some kind of shower head with a speaker that one is $189.99 okay then let's see what else they got going on I know this is my favorite section they have the was it the lobster tails of 244 and of course you know they had the king crabs for 249 these actually went up they used to be 239 so those actually went up ten dollars. Oh, that's cute. Look at this little storage caddy. It's an under the sink storage caddy. That's cute. It's twelve ninety nine. Yeah, look at this. They got the farmhouse. I mean, not the farmhouse, but the they have the barn doors. Look at that. One ninety nine. Is it the kit? Yep, and it has the kit included. Oh, y'all know I love barn doors. Look at that. I need to get some measurements. Let me give me some measurements real quick, y'all. They have this organic avocado rent salad kit. So it's on sale for $4.99. It was $6.99. I think I'm gonna try this one out. Yeah, I think I'm going to get this. Also grab some of this spring mix. Organic spring mix. I think that's a pretty good deal. And we are always um, using these sandwich bags. So I'm going to pick these up too. <laughs> I'm an old school man. I only want to fall in love once with an old school What's going on, family? Welcome back to Meech and Monica. It's actually like two days later, I think. I just left y'all hanging on the last video and never picked the camera back up. I never showed y'all what I picked up from the grocery store. I never showed y'all what I picked up from Hobby Land. So, I guess we'll get into this grocery haul. You all should already know from Costco, I picked up some king crabs. It's actually been a minute since I had some king crabs and I have been craving some fried king crabs. So I will be making those today. I also picked up some flounder, salmon, 
Publix had these organic drumsticks, buy one, get one free, so I picked one of those up. And if you are not familiar with Publix, on their buy one, get one free, it's half off of the price that's listed. So unlike other stores where you have to, you have to buy two items, meaning buy one, get the other free at Publix, or at least at our Publix, you don't have to buy two. If you buy one item, it's just half of the price of the item. I also picked up this broccoli from Sam. From Costco, I picked up this rotisserie chicken, romaine lettuce. This actually came with um, five. But like I said, this is like two days later, so I've been using some of these items. This Southwest um, chopped salad kit, I picked this up from Sam's. I actually had two of those. So that's what I have left from that one. And then I saw this at Costco today. It's a salad kit. It has green and red cabbage, romaine lettuce, kale, and then it has like an avocado ranch dressing, carrots, corn, um, cheddar cheese, and then it also has, I guess it has two types of corn. It has a dry, some type of dried corn, and then salted corn flax chips. So I guess those are like the little crunchy chips. So I purchased that along with this spring mix. One of the reasons I wanted to show you all this grocery haul was because I know a lot of you all say you kind of wanted to see what items I was buying, you know, since, of, of course, I'm pretty sure a lot of you already know by now that Demetrius, um, we found out that he was diabetic. So I'm changing up some of the items, well, a lot of the items that he's eating. And a lot of you asked me to show you some of the items that I would be buying and also making for him. So that's one of the reasons why I wanted to show you this grocery haul. I also picked up these English cucumbers and they come three in a pack. But like I said, I used one and I picked these up from Costco. Some asparagus, some cantaloupe from Publix. This actually is for my salad. I like putting fruit. I'll be eating the fruit, but I like putting fruit in my salad. So I picked this up and also some macaroni salad for my salad and what else? And this diced ham. I picked that up for my salad and this fresh broccoli. So I like to put all of that in my salad. Some almond milk. Dylan likes to make his protein shakes in the morning and he used the almond milk for that. I also wanted to try these egg wraps um, with cauliflower. So we'll see. I actually, after I purchased these, I was watching somebody's video. It was just a random video that popped up and I started watching it. And she said that she purchased these and she did not like them. So we'll see. Hopefully I can doctor them up a little bit. And so we'll see. I'll let you all know, you know, if Demetrius like these or not. My husband loves these um, chicken skewers, so I picked those up. And we've had these before. They are really good. Picked those up from Costco. This is a new item, chicken and apple sausages. So I'm going to make some um, sausage and cabbage. And I think I'm gonna do like cabbage with onions, bell peppers, and then do the sausage. So we'll see how he liked that. I actually saw these in Publix and I wanted to try these out because I love like the sweet and savory flavor. So this is um, the smoked chicken sausage with pineapple and bacon. So I'm gonna put this, um, I'm gonna put these on the grill and see how those turn out. Another item that I picked up from Costco was the squash and zucchini mix right here. And I'm actually gonna make Demetrius some zoodles with that. Um, that way I can make him like spaghetti and different things like that without using the noodles. So that's what I have this for. I also saw this at Costco that I wanted to try. I figured that we can, um, I figured we can grill these and I can put these on like, um, lettuce and Demetrius can eat this like a hamburger. So 
I will let you all know how we like those. I actually wanted to try these out. These are some cranberry and jalapeno chicken meatballs. And like I said, I love the sweet and savory flavor. So I figured those would be good. I'm gonna show y'all how, I ain't show y'all how none of this stuff looks. So that's how they look. So I'll let y'all know how we, you know. Y'all will probably be seeing a, some cooking videos coming up with this stuff. That way, we could just kind of let you all know how it tastes. That way, if, if it's good, you're not going out wasting money or anything like that. This is how the chicken burgers look. I, can't, I actually can't wait to try these because I love turkey burgers, so... I'm guessing maybe it'll kind of taste, kind of sort of taste the same <laughs> as a turkey burger. Let me know, by the way, if you all have tried any of these items that we have not tried yet. And I also picked up these little individual packs of chicken breasts. And they are really good. We've had these before. And they actually come, it's 10 of them. But like I said, I've been... Picking out of them, making different meals for Demetrius and stuff like that. But it's 10 in a pack. And this is how it looks, if y'all can see that. But they are really good. I just, you can, they're already cooked. So, like, if you have a, if you're making a salad, you can just chop them up a little smaller or leave them like this. Put them in a the salad. But I like to heat mine up. But those are really good. Like I said, come 10 in a pack. And I also picked up some turkey bacon. Y'all know I love this turkey bacon. I picked it up from Costco. It is so good. I picked up this cauliflower crust pizza. I actually made this um, for my husband. So I had the pizza and then I just added some of these chicken bites to it. And I'll insert that video. So if you all want to see um, how, because I think he... Yeah, I think he recorded himself, like, tasting it and saying what he thought of it. But I thought it was really good. But I'll insert a video of how I made this. Well, it's really nothing to make besides just I just put the chicken breast on it. But to me, it's good without the chicken breast. But if you just want meat on it. um, But this is very good. I'll insert that when I finish with the grocery haul. I also picked up some eggs and these containers because my husband when he take containers to work they just disappear and they never come back home so i had to pick up some more containers so i could pretty much you know kind of prepack his stuff for work so those are the containers i also picked up this dinnerware set from costco because when we first moved into this house i got rid of the dishes that we had because i wanted some more but the ones that I purchased are not microwave safe. Um, so, you know, when you put put it into the microwave and you take it out, it's hot. So, I needed to get something that we could put in the microwave to heat up food. So, I purchased those. And those were $19.99. I think I probably showed it in the video earlier. I also picked up these cups. These were a really good deal. I want to say they was maybe like $5.99 or $6.99. I've purchased these before and they last a long time. So I picked those up. It's done. Um, dish detergent. To my surprise, they had this gallon of Germic. So you already know your girl picked that up. And they had a five pack of the Clorox disinfecting wipes. I picked those up. Um, some Cascade for the dishwasher. And I also picked up these Ziploc bags. I had some other items over here in the corner. So I picked up this lip, um, let me see, one, two, three, Miss Dash seasonings. So I picked up the lemon pepper. That was really good. I already used that. Garlic, herb, um, just some table blend. And I really like this. This is my first time um, using this, and we used it the other night. But uh, it's a um, the pink Himalayan salt with black pepper and garlic. This was really good. 
You all know I always use the complete seasoning. I also pick up just some Dijon mustard. I'm gonna play around with some stuff, um, some recipes with that for my husband. Some ranch. Um, pepperoni because the kids are making um, their own little miniature pieces. I'm gonna show you what, how they make those. Or I'm gonna show you the like base that we use for those. But this is for the kids pizza. And of course I have some pizza sauce. And then I purchased this sugar-free barbecue sauce. So we're gonna test that out. Let me know if you all have ever tried this barbecue sauce. Buy them this naan bread from, they have it at Costco, but I purchased this one from Sam's. And you basically just turn your oven on 400, put your pizza sauce and whatever toppings and bake it for maybe about 10, 15 minutes and it's a really good pizza. So for those of you that have kids and they like pizza and you wanna, you know, they wanna make their own pizza, that's a very good, quick and easy recipe. But anyway, family, so yeah, that's the grocery haul. I'm actually gonna go ahead and insert that video that I was telling you all about with the um, pizza. I wanted to show y'all just this really quick meal that I'm making for my husband. I purchased, which you all already saw in the video earlier, this cauliflower crust pizza. And this is how the pizza look. And it has uh, zucchini, red and yellow, red, yellow, and green bell peppers, onion, and it has like three cheeses. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add these uh, chicken breast bites to the top of it. And then I'm just gonna, you know, follow the instructions on the box. So I just wanted to show you all this really quick because this is like a, a quick meal. So if you are on the go and all of that, you don't have to worry about trying to eat the wrong foods. So I basically pick meals like this up so if just like now I am actually rushing to <laughs> throw him something in the oven and I have to go pick Dylan up. So you don't have to always, um, I think I told you all, like I didn't want to use a lot of processed food, but in this case, you know, real life, realistically, you don't always have time to fix like a whole meal from scratch. So this is a good option and I will let my husband tell you all how he liked this pizza. take this old cauliflower piece out of the oven and let's see how I like this. Oh, it look good. Look at it. Can you see it, Jay? Yeah. Look at that. Look at the crust on it. Look at that. Uh. Ain't gonna be good, Jay? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna cut it. Make it feel like you eating a good real pizza. <laughs> Look at that. All right, y'all. So I don't know if the wife told y'all she put me some chicken on here and the vegetables that came with it. So probably finna burn my mouth, but uh, we finna taste it. You know what's coming out for that stuff? I know. Let's see. Look at a piece right there. <laughs> I know it's hot. It's 
Okay. Now it tastes. I guess it's good. Yeah. <laughs> it's good. See you smiling. I might could get used to this. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I might could get used to this, y'all. Ain't like I got a choice. But uh it's pretty good. Well. No. I ain't gonna lie. It's pretty good. I really can't tell the difference. I can a little bit. It tastes a little green, you know. Are you trying with the? Tastes like grass a little bit. Oh, I okay. can taste that green, <laughs> but I taste the you know the green taste. Like green taste. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like green taste. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like green taste. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like green taste. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like green taste. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like green taste. Yeah, that's the new phrase. <laughs> okay. I can do this. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. I'm going to finish eating. And I'm going to let Monica get back with y'all in a second. And I'm actually going to get ready to make me some. I want some panko fried king crab. So I'm actually going to get ready to make that. But it is like a little bit after one. And I have not had anything to eat yet. So I'm going to go ahead and make that. And by the time I do that, it will be time for me to go and pick my hubby up from work. He's only doing like a few hours a day. He's still not back at work. Um, normal amount of hours that he would usually work. He's not there yet, but um, yeah. So I, I drive him back and forth to work because his vision is still not where it needs to be. So thank you all. Um, for your prayers that have been praying for him. Just continue to pray for him. I know he's going to get back to his um, normal self soon. And um, yeah, these king crabs are calling my name. So I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up um, for this video if you like it. And I will see you guys in the next video. I will also record myself making the king crab if you all want to see that. I'll have that in our next video. And everything that you do, remember to do it big.